Strictly Come Dancing features a lot of glamour and glitz, so it's safe to say the stars, judges and professionals on the show get a pretty penny for their efforts. But you might be surprised to learn exactly how much they make for taking part in the BBC show. Here's the lowdown on how much cash is splashed. How much are the Strictly Come Dancing 2017 celebrity contestants paid? Each celebrity is given a standard £25,000 payment for signing up, but if they manage to stay on the dance floor until the end of October this rises to £40,000. Any star that makes it to the quarterfinals their fee jumps to £60,000. Those who make the quarterfinals enjoy £60,000 which climbs to £75,000 if they last an extra week and get into the semi-finals. While the Strictly winner will be paid £100,000. Celebs can also make extra cash by signing up to the live tour, which takes place in the spring the year after the series finishes. Spice Girl Mel C previously claimed the pay for taking part in the show was not up to her standards as she told the Daily Star Strictly is really the only one of those shows that I would consider. I have had a meeting with them. They ask me every year to do it. The problem is if you do Strictly it's so high profile and you'll find yourself in the sidebar of shame every day. And the money's s. The Times has revealed that the exact amount the stars taking part in Strictly receive will be allowed to be kept secret after the new BBC chairman, so David Clementi, backed keeping a pay loophole. The BBC was made to disclose the salaries of its highest earners this summer. However, from next year fewer stars will have their pay packages made public as more shows move to BBC Studios, an independent production company which includes Strictly which means they can keep their salaries a secret. How much are the Strictly Come Dancing 2017 professionals paid? The professional dancers reportedly get paid around £30,000 per series, while more seasoned professionals like Anton Dubecker earn about £35,000. But some disgruntled dancers don't think it's fair they get paid so much less than the judges when they work harder. They work up to 14 hours a day training their celebrity partners and are responsible for choreographing the weekly group dances. The dancers were furious in 2012 when they got a £500 wage rise and the judges received a £20,000 pay boost. Brendan Cole who reportedly earns around £35,000 told Now Magazine My Money from Strictly Just About pays the bills. I don't have a car. I would like to get one, but until then I'm on the tube. I don't even own my house. I can't afford it. I rent where I live. But Fiery Bruno is not sympathetic to the dancers, saying in the mirror those are the terms of the negotiations. If you don't like it, stop.